For to be carnally minded is death. But to be spiritually minded is life and peace. Carnal mindedness is, is relying on the five senses. There are people who will not believe they are healed except they feel healed. The people will not believe they are prosperous unless they see the physical cash. See, the devil, you are familiar with this, we've taught this over, over, over and over. Satan's job is in suggestions. So, it's, all he's doing is to pat on your shoulder and begin to make you carnal minded, fleshly minded. And once you stay in the, in the realm of carnality, is death. Death in your finances, death in your marriage, death in your, uh, your, your health, death in your the, the, the family. It, it is death. To be carnally minded is death. Carnal mindedness is death. Because it's anti faith. It's anti faith. How long did it take for, 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 for Peter to sink? He, it's just a few seconds that he removed his eyes off of Jesus. He removed his eyes off of the wall. You remove your eyes off of the wall, it doesn't take long for you to sink. Once, you see, we just said, come. Yeah, if you are the one, bid me to come. Master, if you are the one, bid me to come. And I said, come. So based on the word come, Peter stepped on the water. And as he stepped on the water, his eyes were riveted on Jesus. You know, my daughter, my daughter, my daughter taught it. You know, my daughter taught it. You know, whatever my daughter was He said, as long as Peter was looking at Jesus Christ, he couldn't sink. But imagine he removed his eyes off of Jesus Christ, he started sinking. That's how it is for people to start sinking in their health, in their finances, in their relationships, in their marriages, in, all, in, their, in, their, in their careers, in their work. In a, it was a, a, any area where you are believing God for, we must have a focus. Your faith is on the heart. You must focus. 